Uh, they got evicted and um, councils come out every now and again to give it a clean up. Welcome to vlog. What vlog is it? 17. 17. I guess I'm kind of a vlogger now, aren't I? <laughs> I think you better get over 20. A lot of people would say I'm a vlog. Do you reckon 20 before I can call myself a vlogger? Okay. Alright, well we're getting there. Uh, it's uh, wet today, which is unfortunate because I left that grass too dry out. I can't get rid of it till Monday when the recycling facility opens, uh, so I don't want it rotting away in bags. I've got to go out there anyway today to pick up my charger, which I did leave there. Uh, we're also going to have a look for the next Fremo Friday. Maybe we'll find something while we're out there. A few other things to do. Who knows what will happen? Uh, and Nicole's coming along too. Quick visit to store hub. Nicole hasn't seen the storage shed yet, apart from in videos. Oh. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> My dirty secret. So yeah, I've got to order another one of these. Yeah, it's handy. This is this was handy the other day. Again, if I I need to bring some tools so I can try and get that key out. So very glad I decided not to finish this job today. It's very wet. Look at that, raining now. God, this stuff's gonna come back quick. I think I can just go in. Maybe I'll ring him. So I just wanted to stop by and grab the charger that I left here anyway. I was kind of hoping that I could find somewhere else around here if it was sort of dry enough just to run over it with the skag to start another one, but it's too wet today. Good thing I got stuff done yesterday, eh? Yeah. It's a go and have lunch kind of day. Yeah, let's do that. I know, but I was hoping to get some stuff done. I was just in the area I was driving past, and we have a former uh, Fremo Fridays recipient, Cole, here. How are you, man? Good, thanks, Jim. Yeah, what are you up to? Just waiting on a friend. <laughs> just and, waiting um, on a mate? Yeah, well, <laughs> I was on the train and you, you called in, and I thought you were them. I saw your friendly face. He was, uh, this man was the first man to give me a hug on Fremo Fridays, so um, yeah, I'll show you some vision of that now. Your yard, and I wanted to see if you wanted me to mow it for free. You can't do it for free, sir. Absolutely, I can. Yeah, I make videos. Cuddles! <laughs> I don't know yeah, if I've had well, a cuddle before. Well! Anyway, man, have a good day. Good Thanks. to see you. Just driven past another place that I did for Fremo Froze maybe six or eight months ago. I want to find out what's happened here. We'll go ask the neighbour and then I'll show you. Hello. Yeah. How are you? Good thing. I'm the mower guy. I know who you are. <laughs> how are you? All right, thanks. How are you? Good, you're not on camera, it's just me. No, it's what happened next door? Uh, they got evicted and um, councils come out every now and again to give it a clean up. And how many times they cleaned it? Uh, yeah, I'm about to complain again. Yeah. Um, maybe when they first moved out and then they came back and did it again. So they got evicted? Once. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wasn't, weren't they there for like 20 years or something? Or? Yeah. So this will be like this till they knock it down? They're not knocking it down. They're going to rip it out the inside and then redo it. Oh, you reckon they are? That's what they say. And I said, no. So this is a housing place um, apparently the tenant's been evicted since we've done the Fremo Fridays we did a lot of work here even trimmed a lot of these trees had TLS come out and, and help me mulch all the stuff up too they were great so it's a shame um, it's got like this yeah they boarded it up neighbors telling me that um, Apparently housing are gonna gut it, refit it, and um, put someone else in there. Yeah, it's crazy, hey? It's I was Yeah, I was, just, I was just driving past looking for my next job, and I'm like, oh, I'll just go, go past, see how it looks. No Hopefully they do something soon with it for you. Yeah. It's a little depressing looking, hey? Oh, look, Let's check out the backyard here. I did this with a Ryobi ride on, actually, when I had that for a, a couple of weeks. <laughs> Now, while it does look crazy, crazy wild with the way the grass has been growing at the moment and the, the weather that we've had, um, it actually wouldn't take that long to get to this point. 
I'd go around the side, but <laughs> it's too thick. So I get a lot of people asking me if it gets me down, if I see a place like this that I've done back in this state, and it doesn't really, all I can do is give people a chance. And um, yeah, if they, if they take it and maintain it, good. If they don't, so be it. You know, I still get to make a video. You guys get to watch the video. Um, I get paid through the video, so there's still some positive out of it, I guess. All you can do is give people a chance. The other thing with it is, <clears throat> this is what the vlog is good for, too. I can answer questions more in depth, because so many people say, oh, I don't know how you would let it you know, get like this. The reality is a, a lot of the time it's um, you know, mental health issues that, that these places get like this. Um, it's not just a, simply a case of people being lazy. I'm not saying people are never lazy or whatever, but um, a lot of the time it simply is a mental health thing. I can understand why people would just make the assumption that, that people are lazy. So yeah, all boarded up, ready to be gutted and someone else move in. I don't understand how housing works, but surely it would make sense to knock this down and build two smaller places with smaller yards that are more maintainable for people than, you know, putting people in these. These are large blocks now. Like I love maintaining my yard and I, I don't live on a block this size. And the way these things are designed, they're not really designed for easy maintenance. So if the person's not gonna do it themselves, they're gonna to have to pay someone. And if they're living in housing, there's, chances are they're probably not gonna be able to afford to pay for someone to regularly maintain it. So it doesn't seem to make sense to me. If someone can enlighten me, obviously it comes down to money. 1.30 p.m., someone's got fireworks going. Random. This was a hard slog, this job. I had to make a few visits here. And it was 40 degrees on a couple of the days. It wasn't one of the most enjoyable ones. Anyway, I know a lot of you were always interested to see what these places look like. So the reason that I'll do anyone's lawn, pretty much, is you never know what they're going through or what their mental state is. Uh, it's very easy to go, you know, do it for someone that deserves it. How do you judge who deserves it? It'd be cool to be helping older people that you know, physically can't do it anymore or anything, but it's just, generally those people don't reach out um, and ask for help, so. But if you are an older person or you know an older person that needs a bit of help, certainly let me know. Found a place while we're in the area. Potential Fremo Friday, so let's go see if we can tee our next one up. Doesn't look like anyone's here, but. Plenty of grass, right up my alley. No luck so far. I've almost got a sixth sense for when uh, no one's here these days. Maybe I could ask the neighbours. That was a nice gentle knock. I'm not having much luck today. Maybe try the neighbour on the other side. Hello? Knock knock. Hey, Do you know if anyone lives next door? Sorry? Do you know if anyone lives next door? No. Nah. No? Nah, they don't or you don't know? No, no one lives. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, no worries. Ah, yeah. okay. Standard. Yeah. Yeah. I'm looking yeah. for an uh, overgrown place to mow. I make videos cutting the grass and oh, yeah. people like watching them, so. Yeah. But yeah, there was no answer, so How I thought. How do you set it up, man? Set what up? The videos, while we're doing the job. Just put a tripod. Well, oh, this can turn into a tripod. Yeah. I've got another tripod, and then I've got, this is a camera here. Yeah, good qualities. Yeah. Yeah. I've got the business cross the road. I want to do videos, me doing jobs too. Do it, what do you do? Windscreens. Oh yeah? Yeah, and I've been wanting to do videos. You know, TikTok, Instagram. Yeah, yeah, I'm on TikTok, Instagram. Like, yeah, yeah like, I've got like 1.7 million followers on there. Yeah. Really? Is, yeah. What? Yeah. Legit or what? Yeah, cutting grass, yeah. Really? Yeah. I I'm like, do I just mow it anyway? No. Do I just mow it anyway? I'm sure, I'm sure you guys would be happy, but yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'll put it to the. I'll put it to the vlog people. See if um, <laughs> see if they want me to do it. <laughs> All right, have a good one. Right, see you, mate. 
I tend to stay away from places that um, no one's in anymore for a few reasons, but again, it, the neighbors are always happy when they get done. So I don't know, what do you reckon guys? Do I come back and just knock it over? Potential, no one's there, um, it's housing. Um, Did you find out from next door? Or? Yeah. The likelihood of mowing taking place today is getting slimmer by the second. It just started pouring a minute ago. Eased off a bit now, but we're gonna get some lunch. Never been to this place, but I've driven past it a bucket load of times. What's it called again? The Allroy. Allroy Tavern. Allroy Tavern. A beer garden out there. No one out there today. I'll let Nicole shout me lunch. Your shout, yeah? Isn't it always? Look at this though. Nice spot. All right, Fremo Fridays. Had a few messages from this lady. She's desperate to get it done. Let's go check it out. I think my services could be used here. Hello. Hello. Uh, looking for. No, she's not here at the moment. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. Uh, no worries. I might have to stop by another time then. All right. No worries. Just tell her Tim stop by. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks. Not having much luck today. She's not here. I have to come back another time. All right, time to draw the winner of the Ryogi Blade Edger, 18 volt. It's the new one. Shame on you if you fast forwarded to this point in the video. I'm really disappointed. Uh, we're going to give away one today. We're probably going to give away one next week as well. Nicole, oh, we've got to find out who is it. YouTube or Facebook. Usual, I win. YouTube, you win. Facebook. Okay, it's my turn. Uh -huh. I win again. Yeah. YouTube again. YouTube. Feel sorry for the Facebook people. Hopefully next week. I might put my microphone on. It might help. Okay. It's... We've got a winner? Patty. Have we got a winner? We have. We've got a winner. Patty5518. Patty5518. You are the winner. Uh, I'll put it up on the screen now. Very important with these competitions. I will not be saying in the comments that you're a winner or anything. There's a few scams getting around. Um, same profile picture, a variation on my name. I will only announce the winners of competitions um, in the vlog. So just be very aware of that. Congratulations, Patty. Send me an email, timthelawmailman at gmail.com. See you in the next vlog.